So the Far Right Thinking Company is uh, Pollinizer's R&D arm. It's an environmental R&D company looking into insect and pollinator solutions. Our work is quite important because recent studies have shown that insect biomass is down by nearly 60%. We rely on insects for our agricultural food webs as well as ecological services that they maintain. And if we don't secure this, um, this is going to have a knock-on effect, uh, not just to us, but to the wider environment. So with the support from ATI, we have developed a moth box so we can remotely monitor moths. We want to monitor moths because they're a really good biodiversity indicator species. In the UK, there are 896 macro moths and our aim is to capture them on camera and remotely identify what species there are across Cornwall. At present, a typical moth trap, a person has to visit the moth trap, let the moths out in the morning, whereas this design means that the light will turn on and then the moths fly away in the morning, so it removes the need for a person to intervene with the moth box so we can turn this light on and off over a number of nights and do long-term monitoring of moths. This allows us to do this remotely and the, the long-term ambition is to be able to identify the moths through artificial intelligence um, and through image classification but for the moment it's a, a remote remote monitoring. So the support from ATI has allowed us to speak to academic ecologists at the university has allowed us to work with statisticians as well as business support to identify a market need for a product. Through the support we've then uh, tried and tested prototypes um, and we now have our design. If we didn't have the support from ATI this would probably be still a dream on the big to-do list so yeah it's been really great to push on the project and it's also enabled us to unlock further funding to um, take certain elements a bit further. So the support has enabled us to gain access and expertise into knowledge areas that we weren't aware of, specifically with the way that the government is now changing their approach to land use and the support for farmers. So now we have done uh, a number of R&D projects with the university. It's helped us gain expertise um, from the academics and also the business support. So we've recently received an offer letter from the R&D Solutions to work with Dr. Lauren Anstall to work on insect pollinator databases and make it into a, a shiny app in the statistical package R. So we have a front end website which we can search for different pollinators and then enable us to make specific seed packets to help more pollinators come to an area. So um, the future for the Far Out Thinking Company is that we are looking to apply for Innovate UK funding and also to expand our network of beehives and moth uh, boxes further afield and yeah, make more partnerships and keep doing what we do.